Four abstract paintings named in memory of Nazi Germany's biggest concentration camp, Auschwitz-Birkenau. Everyone who visits the German Bundestag will pass these works when they enter the building. But is it possible to convey the horrors of the Holocaust through art? Music is a good example. Instrumental music where the title suggests what the song is about and the music reflects that. Hopefully that's what I've managed to do with these paintings. The works are based on four photographs smuggled out of Auschwitz where more than a million Jews died. These photos are the foundation of Richter's paintings. He worked on the series in 2014, typical of his style, the layers of paint are scraped and squeegeed, suggestions of smoke and ash. The 85-year-old painter donated copies of his piece to the Bundestag as a symbol of how Germany deals with its dark past. The entrance lobby now hosts two of his creations. He celebrated as one of the world's most important contemporary artists. Natürlich sind das jetzt wieder of course, these are abstract paintings as well. But behind these abstract paintings, there's a very concrete project. The debate about a part of German history that cannot be erased nor suppressed. Richter says he's glad. For decades he wanted to look at Auschwitz as an artist. The result will be an abstract memorial, seen by each and every visitor to the German Bundestag.